Hi, so welcome back to What The Fate Make. I'm Matt. And I'm Luke. Right, okay, so this week we've been down the uh, snacks aisle. Probably my favourite aisle. I know, yeah, definitely. Time, but yeah, it's got, got to be, hasn't it? Absolute icon. Powerhouse. Pringles. Sour cream and onion. They're just iconic, really. If you no, don't know what they are, where have you been? <clears throat> so, right, okay, what have you brought to the party then to uh, rival it? I have bought the Snacktastic Sour Cream and Onion. Mm, interesting. From? These were from Lidl. Okay, can I have a price for me, please? Uh, these were £1.33. Okay, £1.33. Cheap. £1.69, uh, which I have to say... Um, isn't bad. I have to point out at this point the uh, they are one sixty five grams, so you can actually get the big two hundred. Yes, yeah. these ones they may look smaller, but they're actually one hundred and seventy five grams. So Which maybe there's less scap at the top, which is better for the packaging, better for the environment. So right, okay, shall we uh, break in? Yeah. Okay. Let's start with the Pringles sour cream. Onion. So we just taste that one first, and then we can see what the taste was. If you don't know what the taste like already, then I was going to say, if you haven't tasted Pringles, that's a Pringle sour cream and onion. Say, so where have you been? Thank you. Just get a few of that. As you can see, they're very. There wasn't broken on the top, but they're very in good shape. You know. They're just so. Um, what can you say? Is unique. It's, yeah, well, they are new, unique, but um, just an iconic snack, basically, the world over, isn't it? That. <clears throat> Good. And they're known by everyone, really. Okay. Mm. Brilliant. Right, so. Mm. That's the Pringles out of the way. Right, now, let's have a little look at. Little. Uh, Little's. Uh, yeah, we'll have a look at Lidl's version. So, as you see with the packaging, they look same sort of colour. Um, yeah, yeah, we'll have a look at Breaking, it's okay. Oh, look, look, look at me, they look similar. Pretty similar. Look, oh, no. they look a little bit smaller, they look a different shape, sort of. Right, okay. So if we just Possibly get, wow, if we just get, get a Pringle, and then you can compare them. Pretty damn similar to be honest, so looks like yeah, a bit I mean, more they, flavour and a bit more texture um, on, on the rich. They don't the smell, crisps, but they don't smell as strong, do they? No. But they do look. No, they don't. Pretty similar. Let's give them a try. Well, that's interesting. You know, they're actually a nice crisp in their own right. Oh yeah. But they don't taste particularly sour cream and onion -y, if that's a thing. Um, they're almost like a red salted that's just got a, a spring. Yeah, you can of, sort of, of taste of, um, you can sort of taste the crisp well. I mean this is a bit of flavour. Bit of cream also. They're nice. That tastes more. I mean, they are, but very subtle though, very subtle. They've got a nice crisp to them. And I think going back to, well, yeah, going back to this as well, I think there's, there's, there's quite a bit of flavouring, additional flavouring on on the Pringle versus the, um, the Pr Little. Pringle's got a bit more brittle. Mm. And these are a bit more, sort of, not crunchy, but still are. So, um, so for the, let, what's the verdict then? So for the price difference, Personally, I don't think it's worth it. I'll just Absolutely. go for the Pringles. Same. Absolutely. Same. If you can find them for that price, then, yeah. Because these were purchased from the same shop. So they're both in the middle. Um, both on the same day. So 169, 133. Um, but, but nice. No, I, I wouldn't. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I wouldn't pick those up over, over the, uh, the Pringles. No. But if I didn't have Pringles or I was doing a, an exclusive shop at Lidl, uh, and they didn't have the Pringles. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably pick them up if I fancied it. Yeah. yeah. So, so what would you rate these out of ten? Um, I'd probably give them a six. Yeah. To be honest, I'd probably give them a six. They're a nice crisp, but they just don't have the flavour. Lacking in flavour. Yeah. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Lacking in flavour. 
um, sour cream and onion, make a big statement on, on the front. doesn't really come through for me. If, I mean, um, if you're buying them to taste like Pringles... Yeah. I, I, you're barking the wrong tree, in our opinion, in our opinion. It is only our opinion. I mean, obviously, I, mean. I scored them like a 10 out of 10. I don't see how they could get much better than that, to be honest with you. Yeah. No, same for me. So I think that's the verdict. That pretty so, much Pringles. wraps it up. Them. But give them a try, see what you think. So, uh, and let us know your comments as well. We're always interested to get your feedback as Any well. Any suggestions that you have for future episodes. Yeah. Um, yeah so, so, that's it. Thanks very much for watching. On that, I'll see you again. Goodbye. Make sure to tell us any suggestions and like the video if you want to. Okay, bye for now. See you again. Goodbye.